Hi, this is Mike from Superior Tech here to talk to you about the installation of the TerraGrip traction belts. The primary goal of the TerraGrip traction belt is to provide you with the additional traction needed to get the job done without the damage to your driving surface associated with traditional steel chains. Installation of the TerraGrips is simple but worth discussing because a few pointers will make your installation easier, especially the first time you install the chains. Step 1. Lay your chains out parallel to one another, tire width apart. When you lay your tire grips on the ground, be sure the latch is positioned to the outside of the tire as shown. The rivet head should be down. If your tire grip is equipped with a nut and bolt, the nut should be facing the ground and the bolt head up. It may also be helpful to deflate your tire slightly to aid in installation and increase tightness. Step 2. Roll the tractor onto the chains. When rolling the tire onto the chain, position the tire off-center towards the latch side of the tire chain. This will aid in access to the inner link and outer latch. Step 3. Wrap the chain around the tire and hook the inner link. Wrap the tear grip up and over the tire. Because it is rubber on rubber, it will want to grip to the tire itself so it may be necessary to pull it firmly. A quick note, they may appear too short at first glance, but do not be discouraged, they will fit. Now attach the inner split link to the first chain link. Step 4. Hook the outer latch. Slide the latch through the first link in the chain, pulling it back upon itself and attaching to the chain as shown. If the latch does not comfortably reach the first link, it may be necessary to work the slats to get that link closer to the latch. Step 5. Adjust the rubber slats around the tire and unhook the outer link. Because the slats are made of rubber and have memory, it is necessary to work the slats around the tire for proper fit. Work the slats around the tire and unhook the outer latch. Step 6. Tighten the inner side by adjusting the inner connection one or two lengths. It is now time to start the tightening process. Simply unhook the inner link and move it up one or two lengths. Step 7. Tighten the outer latch by adjusting the latch up as many lengths as possible. Tighten the chains by moving the latch up as far as possible. Once again, pull it back upon itself to tighten it. You may have to work the slats a little more for proper tightness. If you notice the chains feel loose, repeat step 6 and step 7. Lastly, secure the loose end of the chain with the included cable tie. Once you feel they are sufficiently tight, reinflate your tire if you had deflated it. Please do not exceed the proper inflation recommendations from the manufacturer. Your tear grip should be ready to use. You may see the need to tighten them further after initial use as the rubber settles and becomes more flexible. I hope this video was helpful and for any additional questions feel free to email us at sales at superior-tech.com or visit our website at www.superior-tech.com.